when um, when people lose focus, when people when some people lose focus, you know, when they lose focus, when they lose relevancy out of their own incompetence, out of uh, out of nzama uh, and all that, they will begin to create uh, create uh, gossip. They will be creating gossip. You know, to distract people from the fact that they're actually failing. People, we are there. What's your phone? Just say thank you. I know you guys always say that I'm not uh, in support of uh, Mazi Simon Ekman, but Mazi Simon Ekman have literally break the cola. <laughs> And because if there is nothing I have learned from Martin Amdekan, apart from where a civilized world where I live, at least I have learned how to respect women. My someone more have threatened the DOS. I will shut the DOS down if you refuse to calm the gentleman down that always accuse women. I must say this, um, Lord Obi is a big fan of female. And I, I come against anything that would degrade women. And it's any it's sort of bully. Like Simon said, this guy is bullying women and calling them all sort of names. Simon actually narrated that this particular woman in America, she is the pillar behind the IPOP lawyer that is coming to Nigeria to support Nandi Kano, the one you have in America. So she is the pillar behind it. My Simon Epa accused the US of, you know, Backbiting the finger that feed them, and he said it like he said. He said when the finger actually get the soap, or when the finger get the oil, it will touch the whole body. That DOS should calm that man down and warn him to stop abusing women. When you continue to keep quiet, and you will see our mothers be rubbished, insulted, and we continue to pretend and keep quiet without addressing them they will think that uh, you know they are making some sometimes they are making moves so um like i've always said in as much as we will try to avoid the manual Egazu Oha we will be addressing their fuck up. We will be treating the fuck up as they come. Now let me tell you the insult on our women, the insult on our umuada can no longer be tolerated. And this insult is coming from a Nikon Poo who claim to be a member of the DOS. And you know, uh, you know, he's not, uh, this person I, I, is not somebody I should be addressing because he, he doesn't, he doesn't want it. But because of one thing, because a lot of people have been misled and because the leadership of this movement to allow that idiot to continue to insult Umwada. So as we are addressing or we are about to embark on addressing this thing, when this oil, when this manual Hogarotaha, we will not look back. So if the leadership, the DOS, will allow one of them to come publicly and be constituting nuisance without cautioning him, without calling him to order, the time to address them has come. You know, we have uh, somebody like me. I don't want to, I don't want to start talking about, about somebody that is inconsequential. Okay? But, uh, a lot of Biafrans have, have seen him. <laughs> he will continue to expose himself. Go and invite them here. Because 
When they stop is when I will start. I am not, I will not be addressing the attack on me. Somebody posted, they sent me a post of uh, somebody referring to our own mother. If it is about me, I will not respond. And this is not a response. I'm not responding. But I will begin to address that idiot. I will begin to address that idiot. And then I will begin to also address the fact that the leadership is not cautioning that idiot to come and insult our Umwada. And he is part of the leadership of the DOS. <laughs> you know, let me tell you, when I, 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 when I will start my own, is when everybody will, will be least expected. When you least expect it, that's where I'm going to start. And this is, this, what I'm going to do from tomorrow will be a starting point. If the DOS did not call that idiot to order, and he should stop insulting elderly women in America. If the DOS because he is acting as a member of DOS. He is insulting women as a member of DOS. And if DOS did not caution him, what it means is that they are the ones sending him to insult our women. So we will begin to address them that way. You see, the structure and the structure of Mazinam Dikano is final. We will continue to respect that structure called the DOS. But we will not respect the person who is hiding under that structure and insult our women. Mazinam Dikano can never support that. Mazena Mikano knows what it took him to bring out our women. Mazena Mikano knows what he suffered to bring the women out. And some idiot, some albero, who out of, because People were not available. He found himself as a member of the DOS. And of course, we don't, I don't, we don't blame uh, Mazinam Bekan. He uses who was available. So that guy will come and continue to bash on our women. And let me tell you, these same women, these same women you see, are the one responsible for bringing the attorney you see today. Bruce Fenn, Madam Bridget Okafo, Madam Bridget Okafo, that was insulted by this same man. What's the brain behind Bruce Fenn? And continue to be the brain behind Bruce Fenn. But this idiot, the DOS allowed this idiot to come online to insult that woman. To insult that woman. The woman that is doing everything Within her reach, the woman that have stayed and spent 12 hours raising funds, DOS allowed this idiot to continue to spoil the name of the Directorate of State. If, they, and if, they, if the leadership of the DOS did not call this idiot to order, 
we will then hold them responsible that they are deliberately sending him to insult our women online. It is unacceptable. We can't sit back and watch as this good for nothing Nikopu destroying the structure of Onyendu and the legacy of Onyendu Mazenamdikan. In the name of whom we can call Guana Agwata. Why I have come this evening, I want to I want to make this this broker so that by tomorrow morning they will share it everywhere. I know many of you always say Allah Obi always supports uh, DOS, IPOP, Ikenga, but that's not true. Allah Obi always telling the truth. I must say this clear that Allah Obi in any way, in any way we never support where people are bullied. That's why we, that's why we have Allah Obi. Allah Obi is for the voice of the voiceless, for those people that be marginalized. That's why Allah Obi always advocate for freedom, irrespective of which country you come from. We, we strongly believe in freedom. So if DOS are watching and find a man among them bullying the lady, bullying women, Lord Obi strongly uh, come against that. I, I, I will not appreciate such a thing. If the DOS did not call that idiot to order, and if we, if we see any more insult, just one more insult, just one more. One more insult from that idiot. One more insult from that idiot. One more insult on Umwada, on our women. One more insult, we will know that the hand of DOS is in it. If they, don't, if they do not come openly and publicly to exonerate themselves, we will know that their hand is in it. We have kept quiet for a very long time. It is time we focus, focus on the struggle for Biafra. If you do not have anything to offer, you give away. Just fall down, fall, fall aside, and let people who, who have something to offer begin to continue where you stop. You don't use a blackmailing and creating confusion to sustain yourself. The only thing you have to offer is Nzama. 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 They give you money to embezzle it. You turn around and you start to abuse our women, insult our women. Nobody, nobody, irrespective of who you are in this struggle, nobody should condone insulting our women. If they do something wrong, treat the wrong they do. If you feel the women have done something wrong, treat that thing that they have done wrong. Treat that thing as a man. You know, the foundation of the US should be free of, uh, you know, bullying, where idea will be communicated. Simon blows hot and tells you that if this keeps going, that is going to blow the hell out of everybody. And the structure of the US may be shaking to the extent that maybe Nandi Kano, we, we, you know, we regret why he even have those years here. I don't want that to come to that level. Because what is going on here is something that uh, I, I, I can't tell about. The way Simon is sounding it seems like there's something cooking behind. And when they keep blaming these women, and you know Simon keep gathering followers day by day. You guys all know that DOS have been DOS. You guys all know that DOS have been attacking Simon Eban. As Simon Eban say, I refuse to speak. That if they attack my personal, I, if they attack my personality, I will not speak. But when they attack these women, I'm going to stand for them. I'm going to speak out that I'm not going to stand and watch you blame women. I, I must also ask DOS that in terms of blame of any female, we must stop. You know, there's no any way that we bully women. There's no any way that we speak to women the way um, that it should not be. If somebody done something wrong, like he said, call the person to order, caution the person, and if person could not, then suspend the person. Till now the kind of comes out, then you guys can carry on what you guys are doing. 
but coming off and calling people all sorts of names, you know, it doesn't work happen. I'm being shy that a man, you know, can come out and say things like this. It's our women. It's our evil women. It's our Biafra women. We don't need to bully them this way. We need to protect them. If they've done something wrong, we'll call into action. We shouldn't come out and start speaking like women. Men don't speak that way. We speak with authority. We speak with protection. Uh, if they say anything that, um, uh, you know, um, I, I agree with Simon, I agree this one with him, that women should not be bullied. Well, we should take care of our women and uh, uh, stop any bullying of any type. And I'm telling you now, if if Simon should go by this way that you guys are blaming women, I'm telling you, is, um, you are going to lose fans. And we don't want to go there. I hope you guys have called the guy to order and caution it. Because Simon is so serious. You can hear what he's saying. Hear what Simon is saying. As a man, and forge forward, forge ahead. Don't come every day and insult our women in a struggle where we are part of. And a moody high, man. I will tell you, I am, I am not part of a place where you will be bullying women. It's not done. I will defend them. And if you continue to insult, one more insult. Go, I want you to share this video. Just one more, one more insult from that Nikonpu, that inconsequential buffoon. One more insult from him. One more insult to our women. If I will free, we, that, then we will scatter this table. One more insult. The DOS must call him to order. Just one more. One more from today. I will tell you people that no, oh, when the market is I will tell you that where your where your stupidity stop is where my own stupidity start. I will tell you that where your madness stop is where my own madness start. And when I start my own, I will carry entire wind with me. You bully women. That those women that so some of you, some of you don't know nothing. Some of you don't know anything. Do you know that that women they are insulting and calling names? Do you know starting from Bridget to Calf, Madam Bridget to Calf, that woman was responsible for a lot of things that has happened. Those Madam Oyibo, that Madam Oyibo, that are being insulted, they have made something happen, things to happen in this struggle. Madam Bridget is the leader, the woman leader. And you all will want us to sit and watch an idiot who, who I don't know whether, I don't know what he can contribute to Biafra struggle other than ranting and shouting and constituting users, insulting the women, the women that are doing and make, are making things to happen. Most of the things that are happening today, they are coming from those women, you see. Those women that they are insulting. Because some of them cannot talk. And this idiot will come. Take credit of what those women are doing. And at the same time, insult and bully them online. It is unacceptable. And if we have to be spelling it out this way, we'll be spelling it out. Oyendu can never be happy. Mazen Namdekano can never ever be happy. Can never be happy. Because Mazinam they cannot respect women. That I have learned from him. He respect, he in fact, he respect women. If we women, if we women, he respect women. By the way, I came out for my normal routine just to jog down, have a bit of exercise, and do my day. Okay, you guys have heard what Simon is saying, okay? Um, we will be strongly condemn anything to do with bullying. Let's reason. If people do something wrong, call them to order. Tell them they are wrong. And, you know, all, you know, all this should stop. Bring out their wrong and let them put it there. Stop saying people, uh, saboteur, saboteur. No proof of saboteur. You know, you should always saboteur. Then you prove that persons have saboteur people. Not every time saboteur, everybody carry along. Someone made it clear, not only the women in USA that is supporting IPOP. There's some in Europe, in Europe. So every part of the world are supporting IPOP. 
So our women should be protected. You guys should respect them. You guys should give them the guide of honor they deserve. If the woman is bringing the idea, she's bringing the backbone for this case, please protect her. If she made a mistake, conscience her. If she cannot, you know, hit to your conscience, then you can suspend her. But Simon was saying that even the phone that you guys are eating on Aprico, you see, I hate the word Aprico. You know, if you cannot, if the DOS, I'm nothing against, like me, nothing against if you guys have enough money, nothing against you guys paying those in top officials, nothing against you guys paying them some money because they need to take care of their family, they need to eat. A hungry man never struggles for liberation. A hungry man struggling for liberation is just a, a question of time. They will give it up because when they bribe them, they will give it up. So if those top officials have been paid, then they can be paid. But collecting bribe is something I also disagree on. So people on that top position should never, never dare call a bribe. You know, we should, you should treat it the way we treat it in Western world. Western world, when you are giving a gift, you will declare that gift you are giving into. You will tell them why, what is the motive of someone giving you a gift if you are in the top official. That's what you do. The same place we structure DOS. You don't want to structure that DOS the way we structure Nigeria. Nigeria that is all corrupt. Nigeria that has no regard to law. So you don't want to do that. You want to do a place that law works. In respect of whoever you are, the law should be abiding. 